Mm -hmm. You know, nobody's gonna come in. It's gonna be that one little small one that just comes in, and that happens to be the most deadly one. How is going to date Loyalist Kingdom? My name is Dwayne. My name is Jess. What do I have, Jess? Take we have for you. Which Scorpio's thing is worse by Brave Wilderness? Uh oh. How, why would you even want to? <laughs> what was that? I don't know. It's like. I don't know, it was like bug? something, no, it was like something flying in the air that's like, I don't know. But anyway. <laughs> you were just like. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know you gotta kill that bug, you mean. No, that's me, <laughs> like whenever you have like those little gnats or yeah, like flying like around. And like I ignore it, like usually the first few times, but then like once it like flies from my face, like that third time, I just yeah. like. Yeah, you're like a hunter, you're like. <laughs> oh, but anyway, let's stop all this. Tick stings, one night. I'm ready if you're ready. What? It's crazy, but. Oh, that was big! Here we go. One, oh no! no. Oh, oh my God! He is, he is crazy. I enjoy it though. I don't want to understand why I enjoy his pain so much, but like it's for education, it's educational for education purposes. For, yeah, for us to know what to do. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Get stuff view, like this. The Sonora Desert looks like nothing more than Which is Arizona. Fox and sparse plants. Come on now. <laughs> we all know by now. That it is alive with animals. No, no. Yep. 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 I told you. <laughs> These creatures stay hidden. I will not live in Arizona. <laughs> the scorching sun. Yet when this glowing orb disappears behind the mountains and darkness sets in, a menagerie of creepy crawling creatures. Ah! Ooh! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! In past episodes, we have shown you many of these animals. Almost all oh, snakes are fun. I like snakes. And that we as a team consider to what? be biological landmines. I don't like bugs. I ain't got it. so big. And you have what I call the triple S. Snakes. Snakes. Scorpions. Spiders. Whoa. And scorpions. Just the word scorpion yeah. makes my skin crawl. And the Sonoran Desert is home to three distinct species. Mm. The notorious bark scorpion. The striped tailed and the giant desert hare. Oh my we god. Have these they look like before. so angry. I even free I like the bark scorpion, mm. which possesses the most painful scorpion sting in the United States. What? For me, this is also different and extremely nerve wracking. But the reason that I'm doing this is to prove that these scorpions aren't just out there to sting you. He's However, doing it with a black this light? brought about one very LED interesting light. question. The bark scorpion is considered to be the worst. What is the sting pain difference between the giant desert hairy mm -hmm. and the striped tail? Yeah. So tonight I'm going to be stung by both. It just looks like it's loaded with pain in both. Yeah. So. No. Question. <laughs> Warning. Scorpion stings can be Please, incredibly painful I am not trying and to. potentially lethal. Never attempt to replicate this experiment. Why would anybody want to? Shoot. Oh, you know, that looks painful. Let me try it. Tell yes. people you can <laughs> right. be surprised. Let's go. Goodness. There Imagine how long he has to, like, look on my left. Mm -hmm. The giant, deadly, hairy scorpion. And on the right, the striped tail. Look how much bigger the other one is. The dirty hair. Right. The common species here in the Sonoran Desert. Scorpions absolutely creep me out. I'm just gonna turn this giant desert hairy scorpion toward you there. Look at that thing. Pinchers, it looks mad. Stingers, it looks very fun. mad. It looks oh. angry. The little striped tail scorpion is actually kind of cute. He's just yeah, gonna look in the corner. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's not. The thing is not cute. It's kind of cute. Two of them up close like that. Look at that size uh -huh. difference. That is compared to that, it's cute. No. You may be wondering to yourselves, coyote, are you nervous? Yes. Oh yeah, I am definitely nervous because I'm going to be stung on one hand by one species of scorpion and the other hand oh, no. by no at the same time. At the same time. Now, the He's reason evolving. I'm being stung <laughs> is to prove that it's not all about size. Size doesn't necessarily matter when it comes to the pain and potency of a sting. So, <laughs> we're going to find out whether the giant desert hairy scorpion is more painful than the striped tail scorpion or vice versa. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at the giant desert hairy scorpion. That's a they just both look not fun Definitely. Yeah. to experience. Yeah. And then you look at the striped tail, you're like, oh, it's tiny. He's almost cute. No. Mm -hmm. That sting can't hurt that bad. Mm -mm. Oftentimes, what you want to look at are the pinchers, or as they're properly known in the scientific community as pedipalps. Now, those are the front arms mm -hmm. and these little claw looking pinchers, right? The pedipalps oftentimes signify whether or not a scorpion has 
potent venom. That's because the smaller the pedipalps, oftentimes the more potent the sting. You'll notice the giant desert hairy scorpion's pedipalps are enormous, right? It can grab onto its prey, squeeze and crush it, and then inflict a sting. When it comes to the striped tail scorpion, the pedipalps are actually pretty small. So I'm thinking this venom may be more potent. But I think ultimately, we're going to test it on my hands and see exactly which one is more painful in the realm of human experience. Oh my God. It's definitely more intimidating to look, look at, at it. Than it. Scorpion. Yeah. yeah. Well, and what's cool about the giant desert hairy scorpion and where they get their name is I can actually see this really well through the light beams there are all of the hairs that are growing on the tail. Yeah. And you may not have known this, but the little bulb at the end of the tail there, yeah. that's called the telson. And the telson is what connects to the stinger, and that is where all of the venom is stored. Of course mm -hmm. it is. Look at it. looks it's so like juicy. It, stingy, right? yeah, it's, it's it does. Right from I'm just saying. It looks like it's filled with, Let me like, get a poison. in your hand, coyote. I'll send you packing. And a little striped tail, he's just curled up in the ball there. Saying, all right. Waiting. I'm waiting to strike. Lights. Maybe if I don't move, I'll be camouflaged and nobody will see me. Mm -hmm. Well, I think since the... Doesn't Harry appears to be volunteering? It's the first. It <laughs> right. The Kaibermans are such. Oh my God. <laughs> the volunteering. Is, is I would have been like, you be quiet because you're not even going to get stuck. Right. By its tail. Then I'm going to actually get a hold of the back knuckle of the tail and the telson, and I'm going to gently place the scorpion in the crux of my hand. I will loosely position it in place, let go of the tail, whap, and I'm going to get stung somewhere in that general area. Now, in case you guys are wondering, as always, we have an epinephrine pen right here just in case my body has some sort of negative allergic reaction to Yeah, because you never know like what you're allergic, allergic to until no you get hit by it. Yeah, no. <laughs> so. Ever dying from either of these two scorpion species. The only real danger that these scorpions possess is that their sting is painful. It's not going to kill you. It might. Well, it might make you pass out. I think it's out. time to compare <laughs> the giant desert hairy scorpion sting to the I feel like the small one is scarier because the smaller you are, the more places you can fit into. Yeah. And you can get to me. It's not easy. Well, and it's not even one sting. It's going to be two different stings. I've never done two stings before, so this one right. is a little bit different, but I think I am. Go big or go home. How is he going to have the okay, strength so to like the open up Down the other here. one to get the second on the one? Shot. I have no idea. I'm also going to move the epinephrine pen down here onto my pack and bring in this GoPro. Rolling. We really need one. The GoPro? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just became real, didn't it? <laughs> Can you scorpion out? Yeah. Oh, oh my god, I got it. It's to move. Look at that stinger, boy. He ready to get you. He is ready to get you. It's a little balancing game there, isn't it? Now, I'm going to keep the plastic container right here because I have a feeling that as soon I as I am too. stung, I'm going to drop the scorpion and then I'm going to have to put the container back on top of it, or at least I'm going to try, just like I have with some of the insects in the past. This arachnid, though, may scurry off the table. If it does, don't worry about it, guys. Don't try to get the scorpion. I'll try to compose myself and get back under control. If it gets away, it's just going to run off into the desert. Right. Whew. I'm Coyote Peterson, <laughs> and I'm about to enter the sting zone with the giant desert hairy scorpion. Are you ready? No. Here we go. One. Ooh. Two. Here we go. Three. Oh, I missed? No, no, it's not again. Oh, oh, there you go. Ow. There you go. Yeah, I get into this container. <laughs> <laughs> Ah. 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 
starting to hurt her more, I think. Round mm -hmm. one. Well, it's not that bad as compared to a bullet ant okay. or a tarantula hawk. That, yeah, that bullet ant. That he built his that tolerance up. Almost just yeah. like beasting. Honestly, maybe not even as bad as beasting. Uh, He's all that stinging okay. built his tolerance up. Yeah. Right for round two. Respect I think it really hurts, but it's just been stung so much. Respect is what you get. So now that you remember what it feels like, you've been through the bullet ant, you've been through the velvet ant, mm -hmm. all these things. Mm -hmm. What's that like now? Like um, nothing. Scorpion, not nearly as bad as some of the other things that I've been stung by. Yeah. But again, remember, oftentimes with larger pedipalps, it means less, less venom potency. The striped tail scorpion, small pedipalps, powerful sting. Are you ready? I'm gonna go ahead and get Striped uh -oh. Tail out of the container. It's, it's about that time. This is one frisky little arachnid. It's so oh. tiny. Got you. Look at this. Ooh, it looks like a little cockroach. The forceps of this. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Come on, got stung right stung there. So this, is, this is a first. This is going to be a first, yes. So Two little. stings, one night. <laughs> it's hard to hold the forceps now with my finger. My finger hurts. I, I know. I'm Kyrie Peterson, and I'm about to enter the sting zone again, this time with the striped tail scorpion. Are you ready? Okay. One, two, three. <gasps> he takes his time. Mm. Oh, Damn. My that God. One. Hold on, he's right there. Let me get him. Ah. Oh, yeah, he took his that time one. with that. Ah, did you see that? Yeah, that one got him good. Ooh, that one got him good. Ah, red a little bit. Yeah, that one got him good. That one got him good. Yeah, that one hurts more. Is it like a burning? It's always whenever he's in pain, he's laughing. Ah, 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 softer part of the finger too. Ooh. Ooh. Wowzer. Not the good pro. I did. Didn't I? <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, I like jolted the table. That one actually gave me more of a jolt than the giant desert hairy scorpion. See? Mm, wow. Yeah. Like, like, that was a small thing. That was a uh, small thing. Yeah. yeah. Ring. We can get y'all. It didn't look like he was going to sting you at first. It was stinging yes. you out, and then all of a sudden, at the very last second, whack. Yeah, because he took his time and said. That's for sure. I'm gonna get you right there. Now, I'm gonna get you right don't worry. I'm about to get you right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. He was like the little thing off of a uh, family guy. Like, I'm gonna get you with my little okay, thing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no, I'm okay. I'm thing definitely okay. Bit. <laughs> What's funny is that my, my finger that was stung by that giant desert hairy scorpion does not hurt anymore. All the pains in this hand. Now, this definitely yeah. hurts worse. Striped tail scorpion, without question, is a more painful sting than the giant desert hairy scorpion. Mm. Do you just have to wait it out, or how do you yeah, like, I don't cure know. this? Close I think to the velvet wait it out. Oh, yeah. The tarantula hawk, the bullet ants. Nowhere close. And he hung on there. Right, yeah, I remember that one. Yeah. Welcome to the scene here. All right. Make them battle each other. It's like, awesome. huh? like a Pokemon. Like death battle. My hands. Exactly what we wanted to happen. And actually, it's only my that little one still staying still, like scorpion. It's come back again. Yeah. So what we have learned is that. Oftentimes, it is the smaller pedipalps and the smaller scorpion mm -hmm. that has more potent and more painful venom. Mm -hmm. I'm Kyrie Peterson. Mm -hmm. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next adventure. You need to show him in like science class, like science or like. Being stung yeah. by these two yeah. scorpion species has hopefully answered the question mm -hmm. as to which is worse. And I think we can now complete the hierarchy. It took its and time. Size it took its time. It took its time. While it may be the Why largest, you keep up when you see that? <laughs> actually comes from the giant desert hairy, followed by the striped tail, leaving the reigning king of sting in the southwest as the bark scorpion. We didn't see that one. So now when I say the word scorpion, I bet for many of Underneath you, it that light is so still scary. Down your spine. However, despite their creepy, alien-looking appearance, an intimidating stinger, 
these animals have no interest in stinging humans. Mm. And oftentimes do their absolute best to Not avoid to. having a close encounter with the human kind. Mm. If you thought getting stung by two scorpions seemed intense, make Ooh. sure to go back and see what yeah. happened oh, to yeah. oh my god. After getting stung 32 times by honeybees. Mm. But see, that's why this didn't hurt him, because he's so used to all these things. Subscribe. Yeah. He had yeah. got stung 30 he's times used to it. Yeah, he's used by to it. all those bees, yeah. and one little sting is gonna make him freak out. Nah, no, no. I just know that I just I don't like small, creepy, crawly things because mm -hmm. it means that you can get to a lot of places that bigger ones can't. Yeah, like you'll like you'll be sleeping in the tent, right? You're like, oh, it's nice and closed. Mm -hmm. You know, and nobody's gonna come in. It's gonna be that one little small one that just comes in, and that happens to be the most deadly one. Yeah, like. That's why I don't go camping. No. I don't do that. I don't do that. I, my camping experience was not fun. So. Yeah. But anyway, guys, please comment below. So if you think, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Subscribe, guys. Do